Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to see a short video on reporting settings in Pega and how it is useful in our report definition. There are very smart people who are not subscribing and watching my content. Please do subscribe this channel. Let's get started into the topic. We know under records, report definitions are the instances under reports. So once you go and see one of the report, under data access tab, you can see these general data access settings like how many number of rows you can retrieve, what is the maximum elapsed set time and what is the maximum number of rows for export and what is the elapsed time in seconds for report. So you would be seeing that these values are grayed out and you can give what are the value that are required based on your requirement. So I got it out where exactly these are already there suppose if i want that default should be uh, like here 10,000 i want uh, to limit the default reports to 5,000 so where you can see so while i am searching that i have seen like under configure reporting here you can see settings just if you see here you can see settings and there are two variants one is resource limits when running reports resource limit when exporting data from reports these two and we are totally have five things to configure over here one two three four and the fifth one is okay this is uh, this is of same database query so those are here so normally in dev uh, you have a maximum number of rows data to 500 and in production you want to save that more or you want to decrease it more more and this uh, export time also as in dev the records will be less we might uh, require uh, very less time to interact with the database and get the data and in production we might have number of uh, records and uh, many uh, database and indexes and everything so you want that elapsed time to increase it so you can keep that settings on the environment specific as well so first thing max the number of reports to retrieve if you see this this is pby max record this is an application setting rule you can access those application settings rule in uh, sysadmin as well from here and you can see here right value per production level like sandbox how much development quotation and staging production in the same way this is py query timeout interval this also uh, you can save it to your respective application layer because these are like available and extension extension denotes that we can extend this particular application setting into your application layer and you can do whatever you want and these also you have different levels over here and this is maximum number of records to retrieve. This is most favorite, I guess. This is PY export max records. This is one of the application settings rule. As said earlier, this is available and extinction. Here also you can save it as to your application level and you can give this. Number of reports export at a time. This is PY export number of records at a time. This is also one of the application setting rule. And this category and you have just display so uh, see this is pizza default view these like uh, in the landing page of the report definition we can see this uh, uh, to get it displayed so this is all about this uh, reporting settings in pega i kept it very short so in short time we can learn more i hope uh, i have covered uh, one interesting topic or if you know anything more about report definitions and if you want more information of report definitions i have already posted two to three videos in my youtube channel you please go through the report definition and this as well thank you thanks for watching this video please click on bell icon so you can't uh, miss any one of the video from this channel please share comment and like and give your suggestions in the comments of the video.